Hey, what's up guys? Um, got a few daily quests here to clear and we are also pretty low down the ladder. It's already the 24th today and uh, we definitely have to catch up. So let's see. We could... Uh, I don't know, out of all these quests, we'll just see what we can play here. Tavern Brawl isn't out yet, so that's unfortunate. At this point we are at rank 15. So, last time we were playing Mech Mage, might as well continue with it. Alright, so we're taking on a Warlock here, um, possibility that we might take on a Zoo, which is uh, quite aggressive. Um, so, we could lose if we take on that, but then again, a card like... A card like Melganus or Draxus definitely makes the the opponent a lot stronger. It's, uh, it's a difficult card to handle when it comes to playing Mech Mage here, so really hate that. Uh, luckily I did draw into a fireball, so in the case that he does have Morganus, I can kill it off. Um, let's see what I can do here. Right now I could go with this. I'll go with the Mech War Park. Perhaps next turn I could play the Snow Chugger. That, that's not gonna be uh, mana efficient here, so perhaps I'll have to play Frostbolt. Alright, so it looks like he's traded off. It doesn't really matter at this point. Um, we can play Snow Chugger here. And uh, probably he's gonna trade in the two Lepinomes, which I do not mind whatsoever. Put this apple on your head. He does have knife juggler. All right, let's see what he does with the knife juggler. It's gonna hit. No, it isn't. So he's gonna have to trade. Um, so I'm really happy about that. Let's see what we can do now. We can go for frostbolt, and it's best to deal with the knife juggler as soon as possible. Those cards just such a such a burden on you. It's such a difficult card to handle. All right, so he's gonna go for Black Tap here, Put this apple on your head. and uh, he's gone gone for his uh, second knife juggler. So I'm gonna Frostbolt here. Actually, let's unstable portal first and see what we can get. Excellent, we got that. That's a pretty good card. So we're going to go with Frostbolt, kill off his second knife juggler. Um, now we are in a pretty good situation. Next turn we could play Arcane Intellect and the uh, Shade Pen Rider. But let's see what he can do here. At this point I could play myself Spider Tank as well as Pen Rider and get its combo off, so that's definitely going to be difficult for him to handle. Good thing is I don't have to worry about that knife juggler anymore, but one problem I have is I no longer have my Frostbolt, so that's unfortunate. Perhaps I need to get... Alright, that's good. I got another mech here. Got another mech, and uh, let's hope Goblin Blast Mage does the job. Come on, yes, yes, very lucky here. Alright, so he managed to uh, get rid of two of his minions. Uh, looks like our hand is starting to deplete here, but luckily we do have Arcane Intellect, so we can always get more options. He's definitely playing a zoo deck of some sort. Alright, we can deal with that. So we could always ping off this, the Divine Shield, we don't need to deal with something like that. Um, we could play Tinker Town Technician, I think that's a good card here. And we could give our minion plus one health. So that's what we're gonna do. And over here we are going to go directly for his face. The reason for that is we're trying to apply pressure here and I think it's a good move on my part. I don't think it's a mistake. He can't play Morganus yet. 
so that's a good thing. That's wow, really? He's gonna life tap. That's pretty interesting because life tapping at life that low, especially against a mage, is not a good move. It's definitely not a good move. And he's gonna even trade in the taunt. That was a mistake, so it does not look like this guy is really smart with his moves here. Alright, let's uh, make sure... Well, it looks like I already won, so that's unfortunate for you. We made it far too easy. Alright, that's good. Uh, let's continue on. So this time we're up against uh, Paladin. I will fight with honor. You asked for it. Alright, we don't need that. But it looks like these two are pretty good. These are good cards for our start off here. It's interesting. Uh, our previous game we were taking on a opponent that had 500 wins, as you can see with the golden and animation on the hero. And uh, it seems like we're taking on another opponent here with the uh, 500 wins achievement. But uh, we already proved ourselves from the previous turn that we could easily handle an opponent like that. So we should have no problem handling an opponent like this. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to play two Cogmasters here. And next turn, I'll play the Snow Chugger and charge him for 6 damage. So, I think it's a little, uh... I'm gonna admit that it's a bad move, but, you know what, it's sometimes good to rush the opponent and give him a little bit of trouble here, so let's see what we can do. Alright, that Snow Chugger looking good here. I don't want to play the Mech Warper too early because I don't want it to be killed off. I mean, it's not like you can kill it off straight away, but, you know, with a Divine Shield and him surviving as well, it's, it's difficult to handle. Put this apple on your head. Knife Juggler, that's definitely a card we have to uh, keep an eye out on. Let's see what we can do here with the Knife Juggler. I think the knife juggler is a really big deal. Definitely a big problem here. And we have a secret as well. That secret could very well be Noble Sacrifice. Alright, Arcane Intellect. Looks like we could do some shenanigans here. Let's hit him in the face. We will take out the Noble Sacrifice. Excellent. I think that's a good move. Oh, that's unfortunate. It ended off dying. Well, the good thing is we do have spider tank. So we could always gain back that attack and trade off with the knife juggler. Knife juggler is definitely a difficult card to handle. Clearly our opponent played it a little too early here. Because with paladin you could definitely benefit off knife juggler very well. Because uh, play muster for battle with the knife juggler, and you could bring out something pretty devastating. Let's see what he does here. Could he trade his piloted shredder into my spider tank, or could he possibly do something else? Let's see what we can do here. Ooh. Unstable portal. Looks like we got this. Interesting spawn of shadows. It's a nice card. Let's uh, go for his face here and see what he does. He does have 5 cards in the hand and he does have the option to play Hammer of Wrath. He has the option to play Consecration. And he's going to play a Murloc Knight. Very interesting. The good news is he can't play his hero ability just yet. The bad news is we can't deal with it next turn, so it's going to be pretty difficult here. And now he has a micro machine as well, which is going to be very difficult to handle. Alright. 
Perhaps we could draw into a frost spot. Not sure if that's going to be the right move for me, but we'll have to find out. Unfortunately not. Alright then. Gonna ping him here in the face, and uh, just gonna go and attack him. Job's done. Was that a bad move? Perhaps. But I'm thinking he might trade in his micro machine into my mech warper. I was gonna trade in that with my clockwork gnome. That's pretty interesting. I, I wouldn't do that if I was him. I was gonna go for that directly on the face here. Interesting move. And he's gonna bring out a random murloc. Let's see, is he going to go for my face? I'm hoping he does. No, he's gonna trade, so he's a little smarter than you think. This opponent's pretty smart. Alright then, would be nice to have a Consecration. Alright, Mechanical Yeti, let's see what you can do here. And we're gonna hit off this, we don't need that. Alright, so it's gaining up our uh, attack here. Probably should have uh, dealt with it earlier on. I think uh, I made a mistake there, so next time I better be careful of that. It looks like I'm gonna pay the price here. Oh yes, and he's getting benefits off that, uh, that Murloc card as well, the Murloc Knight. Let's see what he, he's gonna do here. Looks like uh, he's not worried about a flame strike. Wow, he's not worried about flame strike. It's like he's really doubting me here. I could easily have a flame strike. Interesting move. Flame strike could end everything. Oh, I'm not even sure if I play it. It doesn't look like I, I do so. Alright, we're going to concede here. I think you we lost. We don't have Flame Strike. Alright, losing that star is so devastating. And uh, we got these two here. Alright, so now we're down at pretty low health. Let's see what he does. I could always use the coin next turn to go for Knife Juggler and Dire Wolf Alpha. So he's gonna trade and he's probably gonna put off my other one. 